going to begin with a Washtenaw County Sheriff's deputy accused of mishandling an assault complaint. The victim says he was attacked by a restaurant employee because he is Egyptian American and claims the responding deputy did not take it seriously. The now Detroit's Simon Chowdhury is live outside of CARES office in Farmington Hills right now. So Simon, the organization believes this is all because the deputy is a regular customer. That's right. The lawyers for care say this deputy often goes to Pita Pita in Ypsilanti and they go as far as saying that he may eat there for free. Now we were shown some body camera footage and in it you'll hear the alleged attacker telling the deputy that the victim cannot be trusted because of his nationality. Care says none of those comments made it to the police report. Just say Egyptian to any other people. That's one of the comments that has care asking why the attacker is not facing hate crime charges. The attack happened on June 11th when Ibrahim Omar went to pick up an order. Ibrahim is a DoorDash driver and says the restaurant didn't even start making the order until he got there. Words were exchanged by Ibrahim and an employee before the man came from behind the counter and allegedly attacked the driver, breaking his nose. The victim says the man hit him with the butt of a knife. Care claims the deputy has a relationship with the restaurant owner and has gotten free meals there. They say he spent more time talking to the attacker and owner rather than the victim and downplayed what happened in the police report. The report uh, attempts to paint a picture where two men are engaging in mutual combat, despite the fact that he ended up with a broken nose and five stitches. He's going to have to have surgery to repair the nose. Now, the alleged attacker is facing misdemeanor assault charges, but care lawyers say they should be felony charges because a weapon was used. They're now asking for a full investigation into this incident. Now, we did go to Pita Pita in Ypsilanti to talk with the owner, but we were told the owner is out of the country and won't be back until next month. We also reached out to the Washtenaw County Sheriff's Office about these complaints, and they said they actually have not received the complaint in hand just yet, but once they review it, they can comment. Now, CARE tells us, Carolyn, that they reached out to the deputy themselves, and they say the way the deputy reacted to the situation has them even more shocked, and that comment is coming up on Action News at 6. We're live in Farmington Hills. Simon Chowdhury for the Now Detroit. All right, Simon, we'll see you at 6. Thank you so much for the live report. All right, now to breaking news. Said